够噶，去烧你老友下爬，攞啲豉油添。再加啲精血落啲豉油度，而家得啲血，仲有啲精咧。你讲咩啊？我话要你打飞机 B 出嚟嗰啲啊，想唔想我帮你啊 ？Last up, you people know my love for Hong Kong black magic movies. Scorpion puking, freaking like you know crazy sorcery going on. There's like headless chickens running around and stuff like that. And like I said earlier, flying hug. This is this movie's called Gong Gong Tao. It's Chinese black magic. It's like sort of like all those black magic movies from before. Except I'm gonna say this, and this is my only negative about that damn thing. F you CGI. I am so tired of you screwing with all my movies. What is one of my favorite things ever? When people have to puke up live centipedes, for God's sakes! Hey, we don't have any special effects budget. Swallow the centipede, then puke it up. What do we get in this CGI puking centipedes? Yeah, it's a whole bunch, and then they show some live centipedes rolling around. But I'm sorry, Fulci would spin it. Well, he's spinning his grave right now because could you imagine Gates of Hell? You know the scene in Gates of Hell where the dude turns to his girlfriend, she pukes up her own intestinal tract, and in real life they made her swallow real sheep entrails and puke them up. Can you imagine if that was CGI? That movie would be bullshit. And I'm calling bullshit on this movie for having CGI. And you know what else I'm going to call CGI on? Once again, I'm going to rip on the Sci-Fi Channel. I know you guys are tired of me ripping on Sci-Fi Channel. I don't care. I like Battlestar Galactica. I like Twilight Zone. I like those two shows. But I'm so tired of your damn CGI movies. And I was watching one the oh man, was I pissed the other day? I was watching one the other day, and it was like some alien. I don't even remember what the hell the name of it was, except that it had Booger from Revenge of the Nerds in it, and it had Teresa Russell, who's like 80, but she was still hot in it. And I think that's the best use for CGI. Make old chicks with nice racks look hot. That's what you do with CGI. You do not screw with the classics like centipede puking. But anyway, so the, so the alien creature. Just chasing him in this jeep, you know, and the the、uh, the Chad Low looking dude that's in the back of the van, he throws something at it to blow it up, and he goes, you know, let me see you smile, you sucker, whatever from Jaws. He steals a line from Jaws, or no, smile, you son of a bitch. He actually, they had the balls to freaking steal the line from Jaws in a sci-fi original movie about CGI aliens. It was a That is some balls, people, and all I know is shame on you, sci-fi, shame on you. Back to Gong Tao. This movie kicks you in the ass right away. What do you see? What do you think when you see a baby in a Hong Kong movie? You think, hey, that baby's going to be dead in 15 minutes. Boom! 15 minutes, baby's dead, and a cat's dead. Look, I'm just talking about the movie. I don't make the damn thing, okay? A real baby didn't die, right? It's CGI blood coming out, for God's sakes. But it does squirt out of his eyes. It's pretty cool. Dude runs over a cat, and he's like picking it out of his wheel. Fake cat, people. Don't call PETA on me. Come on, I don't make them. I just talk about them. Turns out, cop cheated on his wife in Thailand. Okay, now I'll, I'll give you this word of advice too. Cheating on if you're cheating on your wife in Hong Kong, it's different than cheating on your wife. Yeah, you might get crabs here or something, or you might make some chick pregnant and have to pay for a kid for 18 years. Over there, they put a freaking black magic spell on your wife, and all of a sudden she like her eyes go bloodshot. She gets little black lines on it. She she can't sleep on her back because it's too painful, and your kid hemorrhages blood out of its eyeballs and dies of a thousand stab wounds or whatever the hell, Gong Tao. Spell they put on this thing, and then it turns out that dudes drinking the drinking the corpse fat from like burnt up corpse chins. I'm not making it up. I swear to God, this is in the movie. Watch it, and then when you watch it, then you can question me. He's drinking the corpse fat off their burnt up chin, and then it makes him where he can take his head off of his own body and send it to vampire on people. Right, like flies around with entrails intact on a spinal cord and sucks their blood. It really happens. You got to watch this movie. It's actually really hardcore. If it didn't have the CGI, I think this would be a new Hong Kong horror classic. As it is, plenty gory. There's some stripper nudity, so that kicks ass. And I mean, freaking eyeballs explode. And that's all I gotta say. But come on, 
get rid of the CGI centipede pukin. That's bullshit. You guys might have heard a new song that's not a traditional theme song that was written by Nervous Energy. You gotta go on his MySpace page. Thank you very much for recording the song. Anybody who like watches the show that much and enjoys it that much deserves a little extra special thanks. So I thank you. And yes, I will get to Cannibal Holocaust one of these days. So chill out, people. I'm gonna get to all your requests, even though some of them I've already done, but you guys haven't seen them because it was long before YouTube and all that crap. Anyway, I'm out of here. I got movies to watch. I gotta drink some beer and get out of here. So until next time, Jay Scott Larson, Cinema Hot Boys. Out of here. TW Video Services is proud to sponsor this program. If you are interested in our full range of video and multimedia solutions, please visit us at www.twvs.com.